Hello guys and welcome back to this video. So in today's video tutorial, we're going to be talking about buy bid limit order. A lot of you are getting it wrong and that is why I get a lot of questions, okay? All of these questions, I try to place my trade and then it enter with market order and all of that, okay? It's because you don't understand what order types are. And in this video, I want to explain to you what buy bid limit order type is all about. So if I go to my buy bid app right here, okay? So right here, you will see mine, the default here is scaled order, okay? So if you click on that, yours could be limit or market, okay? So if you click on that, you will see different order types here, all right? So we have all of these different order types and they all work differently. Try and learn how this works. If you join my daily live stream on Telegram and all of that, you'll be able to learn. Okay, the link to join us on Telegram will be in the video description or check out my bio for that. But today, let's talk about the limit order. There is how limit order works, okay? So a lot of us think limit order is to place pending order. It is not just pending order. There are conditions attached to placing, you know, pending orders with limit orders, all right? So if you want to use the limit order, first thing you need to understand is that if you want to place a buy order, all right, this is the current price. Currently, I'm looking at ARK. All right, now if I want to buy, let's say I want to place a pending order, okay, to buy maybe at a lower price and all of that and sell high. What I want to do is first, this is the current price, okay? This is the current price of ARK. Now, if I want to buy using limit order, I cannot buy at a price that is actually higher than the current market price. If I set limit order to buy, currently we are at 0.42. Now, if I go ahead and set limit order to buy at 0.45, even if it is just one fraction, okay, that the price is, okay, whatever it is that is higher than this one, it won't go through. Your order will be triggered at market price. So if I want to buy using limit order, I cannot buy at a price that is higher than the current market price. If I place any limit order to buy, let's say I want to buy at 0.43, what the exchange will tell you is that no, you can't buy then, okay, why not buy now and then sell when the price gets to that level that you want to buy, okay, so if you are going to buy, the limit order must be lower than the current market price, and then if you are going to set a pending order to sell, the limit order or the limit price rather must be higher than the current market price. So if I'm selling and I decide to actually take a limit order, okay, that is lower than the current market price, it will be triggered at market price. And if I'm buying, okay, and I decide to put a limit price right here, if the price is currently above the current market price, the order will be triggered at market price. And if I'm selling, okay, it is the other way around. So if the order that I want to sell, the limit order that I want to sell at, okay, is currently below the current market price. The order will be triggered at market price. It's as simple as that. Please take note of this and learn this. So for limit order, whenever you get a notification or a warning from Bybit that this your order will be triggered at market price, please check the price. What is the current market price and what was your limit price, okay? So if your price is, um, as I said earlier, buying, your limit order must always be lower than the current market price. And when you are selling, your limit order must or the limit price must always be higher than the current market price, okay? If in selling, the limit order is lower than the current market price, it will be triggered at market order. And then if in buying, the limit order is higher than the current market price, it will be triggered at market price. That is how limit order works. And it is important that you understand these basics. It will help you a lot in your trading journey, okay? Now, let me know the next other type that you want me to talk about, okay? Um, as you can see right here, we have a lot of them on Bybit. So let me know the next one you want me to talk about in the comment section. And once again, if you are not on Telegram, join us using the link in the video description or my bio. You take advantage of all the free signals we share there every day, okay? And if you have gained value from the video, give it a thumbs up. If you are new here, make sure that you subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.